What's going on everyone? It's Brain with Jacoji Fine Jewelry, your personal jeweler. Today we're reviewing the anchor chains. Why? Because that's what we do on this channel. Let's get started. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Jacoji Fine Jewelry. Visit my website www.jacoji.com. I'll have all those chain shop program length. It all total up for you. Just go check it out and see what you like. Shout out to my notification squad and as well as my smash squad for all the support on these videos. With that being said, smash that like button. Smash, 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 smash. Here are the chains we'll be looking at today from left to right. We have the three millimeter, four millimeter, five millimeter, six millimeter, and the big boy on the right is the eight millimeter. All solid 14 karat gold. And here are the clasps on these chains. Very heavy duty lobster clasps. Won't have a problem with the durability on these. Let's get going on these anchor chains. Why are they anchor chains? Because they are as heavy as an actual anchor. I'm just kidding. I don't know why they're anchor chains, but they're beautiful and I love these chains. I have the three millimeter, 22 inch length on. And as you can see, it kind of looks like a rope chain from a distance. The good thing about these because of the lengths, how they kind of are like mismatched, it really adds a thickness to it. And you need that personality to really want and like an anchor chain. You got to be kind of a bigger guy or just want something a little more heavy duty looking. Um, it's not the same as going with like a Franco chain where it's really heavy, but it's kind of slim and it's not as like stand out ish, if that makes sense. So these, you're still getting good weight. You're getting a good durable chain but it has a different look that it's kind of an acquired taste, but just check this one out. As I move around, it's still gonna glisten. It's still gonna sparkle like a nice 14 karat gold chain should. If I get closer, you guys can start seeing the detail on those links, but three millimeter, the small size is a beauty. Now I got the two chain look on. I still have the three millimeter, 22 inch, but then I threw on the four millimeter. Four millimeter is a perfect width on any chain design and 24 inches is a great length as well. So if you want something casual every day, these are the two um, widths and also lengths you need to consider. If I take a step back, you can see it's nothing that's too tight, too short, and it's nothing that's too long on me. So I do love this and I love this look. If I had a little extra money to spend and I love the anchor chain, then this is definitely something I would consider. You could always throw a pendant on one of these and just have it for later. So keep that in mind when buying the chain, of course but just look at it, screenshot that. Step my game up to the five millimeter. This chain is weighing between 40, 45 grams. Um, so it's not bad in weight, it's nothing too crazy. And you get a great look with a nice thick chain, nothing huge, nothing you know too small either. So if you just want something in between, the five millimeter, again, on any chain is gonna work for you. So check that out. Now is the width gets bigger you can start seeing the link design a little bit better so at the smaller width just kind of like any other chain as well guys you kind of just see a chain you can't really distinguish what it is but as the widths get bigger four or five millimeter plus now you could definitely tell this is an anchor chain when you're wearing it now we're moving on up to the east side i think that's how it goes to the six millimeter 24 inch length um, now it just from you from if you guys are looking at me It kind of just looks like a big thick rope chain at this point uh, We get up close and personal you could see how those links Mismatch a little bit and give that distinguished anchor chain Look that some of you guys might love some of you guys might not care for the link But in my opinion, this is a nice if you kind of want a bigger link look then go with the anchor chain I want to show you guys the difference between the five and six. I know at those sizes, when you're trying to debate, should you go spend the extra money on the bigger width? Is it worth it? Here it is. This is the five. Obviously, this is the six. So you can tell the difference between the two. So it's just up to you, your price range, your budget, what you're comfortable with spending on an anchor chain. Last but not least, we have the eight millimeter width at a 24 inch length. I have to keep my head up because this boy is heavy. Go check the weights out on the website. They'll all be in the description. But again, this is the grand finale. This is just a nice link. Again, it's nothing huge. It's nothing crazy. But you definitely notice that you have a good, solid 14 karat gold chain on. It's just something that you could feel the weight. And that is key when you're going to invest in a nice, thick chain. You want to feel the weight. A lot of times you get these hollow chains, 10 millimeter, 12 millimeter hollow, hollow chains. 
and there's just no weight to them. It might look nice, but at the end of the day, there's no weight, no real value in that chain. So go with something nice and thick if you love this link. Check out the bracelets. We got the width 5, 6, and 8 available on the website. Go check them out. Very nice bracelets, solid, you know, something you want on your wrist that you're not going to have to worry about. These links are just, they are very tough, very strong. So just check this out. This is the look that you like, then this is the bracelet that you need. Let's take one last look at everything that we covered today. All the sizes, again, will be on the website. It's fun to do different chains like these. Of course, I'm not going to sell all these anchor chains. It's more mostly ropes, Francos, and Cuban links at this point. But everyone likes something a little different, and it's good to get show you guys different chains. Maybe you'll fall in love. I know a lot of people didn't really like the Francos until I made video and video after Franco, and people just kind of it grew on them, and they realized how nice of a link the Franco is. So hopefully you guys check these out, like this video. That's it for today's video, and we will see you on our next jewelry video.